What's up, guys? Got another e-bike battery update. Uh, I want to start with thank yous to a Charles Tatakis, Tatakis? Uh, and also, of course, uh, W19 Nelly, A L Y. Yep. Thanks for the advice. I am not going to be using a BMS, and I will be using a balanced charger. I've got this EV Peak CQ2. It charges up to four 6S batteries, 200 watts overall. I'm going to split uh, my packs up into four and three uh, packs uh, and check it out. I spot welded the nickel plates on. Look at that. Spot welder did all right. I'm going to hopefully do a review and link it in the eye in the corner of the screen when that's done. Uh, it's pretty decent. Uh, I've also soldered on uh, the wiring. Use some tin gauge wire, and the connections I have are XT90 connections, and it's looking good. Uh, I did do a preliminary testing, and it got to 107 degrees. Right now, the cells are sitting around 3.9 volts. I rode around the neighborhood a lot, and full throttle <laughs> a lot towards the end. It was really cool. I am coming up with this no another idea. Ugh. I hope I have the time, but I'm going to be making some shrouding with the 3D printer, and I'm going to use some 120 millimeter fans for computers because I've got a couple extra of those, and I want to do like a forced air cooling of these batteries. Oh, man. Stay tuned for more e-bike battery updates because... Uh, this is going to probably get out of hand, but in a really cool way. I don't want to plug in like 30 plugs when I charge my bike. I want to plug in a plug and, and just maybe press some start buttons. I don't mind pressing like four start buttons or whatever. Um, so I was racking the brain and searching Amazon for plug connectors, and I was like, yeah, motherboard connections have 24 pins. I think it's like 23 uh, actual wires in them. And so check this out. It's an extension for a motherboard power supply uh, connection. So I'm cutting that in half. I'm going to put all the charge uh, balance leads and even the charge ends because of the um, the low amperage that they will carry. Um, I'm going to just make one plug for these two batteries. So when I plug this in, I'll just press some charge buttons and it'll be done. Ah, man. Share your thoughts below, please. Uh, the influence is greatly uh, appreciated and uh, accepted because I'm not going to waste my time frying my batteries at 4.2 volts with the BMS that uh, I can't even monitor. You know what I mean? Whoop. Stay tuned. Press the buttons that you got to press to do things with, you know, please. <laughs> and yeah, I hope that helps. See you later, Internet.